is Shauna here with Shauna Marie's vlog. I am back today with another video. I actually have a little small haul that I want to share with you guys. Um, it's actually kind of like a little fun. Um, I have not done a Dollar Tree haul this whole little um, year so far in 2024. Um, I do go to the Dollar Tree, but I don't go like um, hunting for a bunch of stuff. I'm just not really into that anymore. I love the Dollar Tree, don't get me wrong. Um, I go one, one time a week, one time every two to three weeks. And it's mostly to get the items that I normally get from there. The snacks that my kids like from there, um, the coffees that I get from there. And um, you may hear a dishwasher. It is late in the evening whenever I'm filming this and I normally do not film this late, but if I don't show you guys this, um, I won't be able to. And it's kind of a fun little haul. So I did want to share. We're actually having a Galentine's Day party um, with my job. We ordered um, all the same pajamas, and I'm not staying the night, <laughs> but it's kind of like a little, um, you know, we have the same pajamas. We got those off Sheen. They're the, like, silky pink ones, so they're super cute, and we're all going to be matching. It's like 13 or 14 of us girls that are going to be there. So, we have different little things that we are going to bring. So, my um, items that um, I am bringing is I'm going to make a candy salad um, with all Valentine's Day type of candy. Sorry about that. I have loud children that live in this house. Teenage loud boys. <laughs> all right. So, I am bringing the candy salad. Um, and it's just going to be like different um, Valentine's Day themed candy just in, in a little bucket. And I'll show you what I have for that. And then I am making a um, fruit punch and pineapple juice and rum. And I don't know if I'm going to do ice cream in there or like some type of sherbet ice cream in there. I'm not really sure yet. I have I got everything except for the ice cream or the sherbet that I'm going to put in there. And then I am making um, candied grapes. They're all over TikTok right now. I've never made them before. But they're like, um, you can make them any color that you want. You can do pineapple, oranges, just any kind of fruit. I'm just doing grapes. So, with all that being said, let me show you the items that I got for that, okay? So... I did so I did get these two fruit punch from Dollar Tree and this is just the lemon berry squeeze I did get two of them because I'm going to be making a big jug of it and most of these items are from Dollar Tree um, except for like the candy grape stuff that I had to get from Michaels and then I got some face masks that I'll show you guys that I got from Fabulous. So this is the pineapple juice. I think this actually came from Dollar General, not Dollar Tree. I just put it in with my stuff. And then I got these um, pink cups for the punch that I'm gonna make. And the rum is in the freezer, so I'm not gonna show you that. So I did get two packs. You get 10 in each one, girly, pink, um, it's just gonna be lots of pink, reds, whatever color. And, um, yeah, so I got two packs of those. And then let me show you my nails really quick. Got it that color to, um, match the pajamas. So I got this little heart shaped bowl from the Dollar Tree that I'm gonna put the candy salad in. Now this is not a big haul, okay? And then I got the little scoops. You get two of them to scoop the candy. Super cute. I look for the pink ones, but um, this ready color will be just fine. 
Now let me show you the candies that I will be putting in the candy salad. I'm gonna put the Sour Patch um, Sour Hearts, Black Raspberry, and I've tried most of these candies because I made a, if you follow me on TikTok, you saw that I made a candy salad here for our house and it is so good. That's all over TikTok right now too. And then I got the Warheads um, hearts. You get blue raspberry and watermelon and black cherry. Lots of candy y'all. I got these nerd um, clusters that, I think these came from Dollar General as well. Dollar Tree don't have this, the pink, um, like Valentine's Day ones. So I got that from Dollar General. This came from Dollar General too, I believe. And I um, know, oh I'm sorry, it's a mix. Um, these little sweet tarts came from Dollar General. And then the Haribo Sweet and Sour Hearts came from Dollar General. And then these are not necessarily um, Valentine's Day, but they're red, so I thought that was, would go good in there. These did come from Dollar Tree. And then I got the Sour Patch Hearts. And then, I don't know, I got the Warhead Sour Popping Candies. I don't know if I'm going to use this in the candy salad or on the grapes, but um, I may use these on the grapes. And then I got the Coastal Bay um, Cherry Jelly Heart from Dollar Tree. And then I got some conversation hearts from the Dollar Tree. And then I got some watermelon rings um, from Dollar Tree. They were red, so I just got them. And then lastly, I got um, the gummy tic-tac-toe. Did this come from Dollar Tree or Dollar General? can't remember this may have came from Dollar General I can't remember but that's what that looks like so hopefully that will be I think it'll be enough candy um, to go in the little heart so cute so I looked for the little cups um, like the in the Valentine's Day section like to um, you know put little scoops I couldn't find any, so I'm just gonna take these and just put some little candy up in there, right? Or you can put it on your plate, however you choose. I'm just gonna set these little um, cups there. You get 20, or I think someone, if they don't wanna use that, I just didn't wanna use these big ones for the candy salad because that, I mean, that holds a lot. This doesn't hold as much, the little red Solo fake cups you know you get 20 of them so i'll just set these beside the little candy salad and then you can just you know take your scoop and dip some because if i set that on there i mean that that's a big old scoop but we'll make it work and i'm almost done y'all it's not a lot um and i did get this little tin um heart um it says hey 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 your cutie Hey, your, <clears throat> what does it say? Hey, your cutie? I thought maybe it said, hey, there, your cutie. Or, hey, your cutie. Or, cute. Y'all cannot read. Hello. Hey, you're cute. Where did I get cutie from? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Take me back to kindergarten, y'all. But I just got this little tin. And I'm going to put the candied grapes in here and I'm gonna just fill them up that's the plan for that so let me show you the mask that I got from um I was gonna get them 
at first I looked at TJ Maxx to see if they had like a, a bigger pack of Valentine's Day like themed masks. Not necessarily Valentine's Day, but just something, you know, cutesy and girly and stuff like that, you know, on the packaging. Um, they really did not have any. It was mostly like Hello Kitty and Mickey Mouse and stuff like that. And I didn't want that. So I looked at Target and Target did have some, but they were $3.99 a piece. And I'm sorry, I did not want to spend four dollars for 15 I, I mean i needed 13 of them and i was not about to spend four dollars a piece on a mask no ma'am so i got some different ones from five below and if they don't want to do like a face mask i got some i got a pack of lip masks so if they don't want to do a face mask, they can do either a lip mask. Let's see, they're taped, so I don't want to open that right now. And if they don't want to do either a face mask or a lip mask, I got some eye mask. So there was five in here, and then there's five in the eye mask, and they were just red, so that's why I got them. <laughs> Not necessarily Valentine's Day, but red. So I did get those. So they are gonna have options. And then if they wanna do a face mask, they can do a face mask. These are so cute. So this one, um, and these were $1.25, just like um, Dollar Tree. That one with like the little donuts isn't, I know it's not red or pink, but it's, you know, like foodie-like. So it's very, you know, candy shop, you know, valentines -y a little bit. So I got that one. I got two of the macarons. I wonder why I didn't get two of the candy shop, but I got two of everything else. That is so weird. Two of the little macarons. And then two of the um, little cupcakes. And then two of the ice cream cones. That is very odd of me um, that I didn't get two of this, of the donut ones, but it is okay. It is okay. And then lastly, y'all, I got to make the candied grapes. I went to Michael's, and this stuff was supposed to be like $15 but she used a coupon and I didn't even ask. Um, if I can show a picture, I probably won't share this video maybe until like Sunday. So if I can share a picture um, of what everything looks like at the party, I may. I'll just have to um, see if I can do that. I don't wanna be awkward and like be filming around them. <laughs> so um, these aren't like, People just hang out. I mean, I hang out with them at work, but you know, these are work buddies, which they know I do TikTok and all that and stuff like that. But um, I, I'll see if I can take a couple pictures and I'll, if I can, you'll see them at the end of the video, okay? So, and I don't know if you guys know, I think it's called something else, like besides candy grapes, but I can't, it's like a Japanese um, kind of dessert. I can't think of how you say the word, but um, if you type in candy grapes, you'll like, they're supposed to be like really, really hard and crunchy. You just mix it with um, a little bit of water, sugar, and then some Cairo, um, light Cairo syrup. And you have to do, use a candy thermometer and let, let it heat up to 300, um, 300 degrees, I think. Just take it off the heat. And then like if you want flavoring, which I did want flavoring, um, candy and bacon flavoring. I got the cotton candy. So this will go into the um, the sugar and the water and the caro syrup mixture. And then it says to, you have to put um, like a white um, food coloring in there first so it doesn't look clear. And you had to get gel. It can't be like the liquid. And then I got red, um, 
food coloring too because I want the grapes to be red. Oh, and I also, it's in the kitchen, but I did get some um, um, nerds, not nerd clusters, just regular nerds. That way, um, whenever we're done dipping the the grapes into the mixture, we can, I'm gonna do some plain, just plain red, and then I'm gonna do some probably with the popping rocks or the, the popping candy, like pop rocks. And then I'll do some with the nerds or I'll do some with like the crushed up Jolly Ranchers. I'm really excited to try them. I've never ate that before, but I am so excited. But that is the little small haul for the Galentine's Day party that we are having. I'm so excited. I normally do not do things like this, y'all. I usually spend time with my husband or my kids. So this is gonna be something very new to me and it's gonna be fun, I'm excited, but it's gonna be different for sure. And then I have to work um, Saturday morning early. So this moment is going to be tired, tired. I probably don't even know what I'm getting myself into, but it's gonna be fun. I'm excited. I can't wait. I like to do little things like this or really like plan parties and all that kind of stuff anyways. I like to buy crap, really. All right, y'all, that's gonna be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if I can get some pictures, stay to the end so you can see the little pictures. Um, our party is Friday night, so you'll probably see this maybe on Sunday. Maybe I can get it all edited and put up for you guys. So thanks for watching and consider subscribing to my channel if you have not already. And I'll see you guys on my next one, okay? Bye, y'all.